good morning from Amelia needs to take a shower. Let's advent calendar. We have what is <gasps> it's a little paint set. Wait, does this work? Look at that. It's it it's real, I think. Little tiny little paintbrush. This is so cute. Alright, my elf friend. You gonna paint today? Here's some paint. Elf? You're a gnome. I'm so sorry. In case you were ever curious about what the gluten-free vegan version of pizza rolls looks like, this is them. They're actually not bad, although they're quite expensive. I found them at Aldi. They're decent. Um, they're not quite like that chewy pizza roll, but they're pretty good. And then I dip them in ranch, and, but they're good. They have vegan cheese and sauce and beyond meat something in them. Ta-da! <laughs> Today is a no makeup day. I've decided um, I don't have a black eye. That's just dark circles. I found a recipe for vegan cosmic brownies. So we're gonna try that. I have not had good luck making gluten-free vegan brownies. But these are supposed to be like a mediocre snack cake. So hopefully they will hold together. So we need a vegan egg replacer. I'm gonna melt this butter, vanilla, sugar, baking powder, cocoa powder, salt, and flour. Well, I'm already having doubts considering the texture of this dough is like a cookie dough. But I'm going to trust the process because the instructions say it's going to be very thick. All right, my giant chocolate cookie is going in the oven for 35 minutes. Okay, I added a glaze, I guess, to the brownies. It was just chocolate chips and soy milk. It's what the recipe said to use. And then I didn't have the right kind of sprinkles, but I thought we'd go Christmassy. Um, so now I'm gonna cut the brownies. I don't have high hopes. The texture seems very off, but we're gonna we're gonna try anyway. All right, time for a taste test. Don't mind that sound. That's the dishwasher trying to escape. Cheers. We're closer to brownie than last time. Check that out. I give it like a, a good seven. The recipe said they're sometimes better cold. Maybe I'll put them in the refrigerator and try some tomorrow. But it's still good. I will eat a lot of these. I'm in the middle of a very important ritual called the changing of the masks. <laughs> so basically my favorite kind of masks to wear are these KN94s and I still wear a mask pretty much everywhere in public problem is with the KN94s is I have a small face and so if I wear them normally they literally poke me in the eyeball like I, it goes from here and it pokes me in the eyeball so I have to cut them so here's one I show you I have to cut it so that it doesn't poke me in the eyeball you can you can kind of see that I cut it pretty close to the the nose bridge and I use these masks probably like four or five times each before I get rid of them so I use it and then I put it in a plastic bag with the day on it and I put a little tally mark on it and once I've got four or five tally marks on there then I throw all the masks and I make new ones and it's a new month which means it's time for new masks so I'm cutting a bunch of them these are fun little designs from Amazon um, they're a bunch of different like galaxy designs and then I write days of the week on plastic bags and I put them in plastic bags and here like this one you can see I used it once on Thursday. What happened here? Oh, this hair is supposed to, uh oh. You're supposed to be over here. <laughs> okay, well, we're just 
that's gonna just go over there until I take a shower again. Also, today is a little bit of a sad day because we found out that Noodle the pug died. So I'm wearing my It's a Bones Day holiday shirt from last year. Um, actually, I think you can still buy them, but I'm wearing my, my Noodle shirt for Noodle. All right, that is it for me. I'm going to eat some bedtime brownies. Ta-da, and go to bed. Thanks for joining me on my day at home. I think tomorrow's also a day at home. <laughs> Listen, Vlogmas is not always all that exciting. It's just my days until Christmas, but I'm trying to make it fun. <laughs> okay, <laughs> good night.